If you have been on Discord for a while, you might have seen these special messages called embeds. Only sent by bots. In this video we are gonna make one for our bot. Also this is a part of the series how to make a discord bot without downloading anything so if you're new here make sure to check out this video first. Link is in the description. So without further ado, let's get started. Before we start, the first thing you gotta do is change message to message create because when we were using message it was causing a warning, now it shouldn't happen. Also if you wanna make new commands, you can do it like this. This is how you make another command make sure you restart your project every time you make changes. Now let's make an embed command. This will be the title of your embed. This will be the description. This will be the footer. We have constructed the embed. Now you can send it like this. Make sure what you write here is same as what you wrote here. You can put spaces in between to make it look better. We made a basic embed. Now let's add border color. You need to specify color here. This is called border. You can choose a color from this list. Link of this page is available in the description. Like this. But what if you want a more specific color? You will need to go to this website. Link is in the description. You can also use your color picker. Pick the color you want for your embed border. Copy this hex code. Paste it here with the hash. You can also use RGB, if you know what that is. If you had noticed the list there was an option named random it selects random color for your embed border. This will make the title clickable. You will need to put a link here. I will type my channel link. If you click on it, it will redirect you to my channel. Let's add a field. You have to put the name of the field here. And value here. You can have more fields. You can have fields in the same line by doing this. Just make sure the two fields you are making in line have. Comma. True. You can put a name here. You need to put an image link here. You can also have the user avatar and username. Message.author.username grabs the username of the person who used the command. Display avatar URL grabs the user's avatar link. You can also use image in footer.
Since message.author.username returns a normal text, it can be used anywhere. Thumbnail of the embed. You have to put an image link here. And as you might have guessed, you can use this here as well. Dot set image is same as thumbnail, except the image will be shown below and bigger. You can just leave this empty. This will show when the command was executed. You can also use a custom date. This is my birthday by the way. You can send a normal message with embed like this. And it's not necessary to have it before embed options. And you're not required to have the functions in order. Okay that's it, we are gonna cover command handling in the next part till then bye bye.